artists. Thank you so much. I would also like to thank our jurors, our independent jurors, Max Mason, a local celebrated artist who is known for his sports themes. And if you haven't been to Citizens Bank Park, he has uh, quite amazing uh, public arts uh, murals and other installations there. So quite a, quite a, uh, a well-known, celebrated artist that we have here in Philadelphia. Also, thanks to juror Richard Watson, ex uh, exhibitions director at the African American Museum here in Philadelphia. And also, thanks to our fellow committee member, Sean Stoops, a uh, local independent curator, uh, for selecting all of the artists in this show tonight. Um, and last but not least, and always, a very special thank you to to Hewn, our uh, director of our City Hall. Without his uh, expertise and dedication and commitment, this would never really come together at all. Now, <laughs> the mayor. Now, I'm the first to admit that I know little, if anything at all, about organized sports. I don't go to sports games, I don't watch it on TV, I don't read it in the newspaper. But I do know that this town has one of the most amazing uh, sports uh, enthusiast fans that I've uh, ever come to know. And all you need to do is look at my Facebook news feed to also know that many of my arts <coughs> colleagues are, are some of those fans. But really tonight we have with us perhaps Philadelphia's uh, greatest sports fan of all, our very special mayor, Michael Nutter. Very, very much. Uh, this is a completely sports-based town, as uh, as we know. But uh, please, I'm going to take that on in a second. But please give uh, Mary and to uh, and all of the artists and all the jurors and, and just all the people involved in this. Please give them a big, big round. Two uh, two young people, uh, not that, two as in T W O. Uh, two young people who are also very, very special to us and whose work is. Uh, all around uh, the walls uh, here at City Hall are uh, Kate and Mitch. Uh, and where did they get to? Kate? Through there? Okay. And Mitchell, and Mitchell left. Uh, so these two young folks uh, have uh, for months, uh, since uh, actually sometime last year, traveled around with me uh, to a ton of different places. Every, pretty much everywhere I went, they went uh, with me. Uh, and uh, some of the result is uh, the incredible photos that you see. This is totally kind of behind the scenes look at what goes on uh, in, uh, in the course of uh, my day and events that I go to. Fortunately, I'm not in all of the uh, photos because even I would not want to look at that. Um, so, I mean, it's really, uh, at times, uh, these are photos, obviously I'm in some of them, so you're looking at me, or it's uh, from uh, our perspective or someone else's perspective. In terms of what really goes on uh, in the city and uh, combining all of these uh, into a uh, show is something that uh, we've really thought a great deal about, wanted to do, and we think is very, very important in terms of showcasing and highlighting all kinds of artists uh, in a variety of different ways. And talking about uh, sports, uh, the first thing I think I want to do, and I really uh, should have done this on Monday, uh, but uh, can we uh, get a big, big round of applause for Women's USA Soccer? We are so so very proud of them. Uh, the you know the score is one thing. It really is about the effort uh, and the commitment and the dedication. And uh, I think they demonstrated time and time and time again uh, that uh, they are uh, at the uh, at the height of their game. So I uh, want to give a big shout out to them. Now my uh, notes uh, for this afternoon uh, tell me about all these incredible things, and we have. Uh, art around the corner with the uh, sports theme. We've got uh, Kate and Mitch with, uh, with uh, their uh, uh, pictures uh, up here. There's all kinds of stuff down on the first floor, which I need to get down there to see. But uh, my notes also told me that there was like um, free beer and pretzels and a number of other things, none of which I've seen. Uh, so, uh, it's like false advertising or something going on uh, around here. But seriously, art and culture, the creative uh, expression, very, very important uh, for this city, and we think that uh, it should always be highlighted, literally right here, uh, certainly on the second floor, and there are cases uh, up on the uh, third, uh, on the uh, fourth and fifth uh, floors as well as a part of the larger uh, effort uh, and support for Art and City Hall. 
Art is very important to the lifeblood of this city. Creates economic opportunity, creates jobs for the young artists, but it also is about uh, the beauty and the wonder of people being able to uh, creatively express uh, what's on their mind, or what they see, or their vision uh, of what a city uh, is really all about. And uh, it's, uh, it is awe-inspiring. Uh, it is fairly well known that I have no uh, particularly known artistic uh, <laughs> capability whatsoever. But I know good art when I see it, and I know the value of it, and that uh, that is uh, the role that I play. So uh, one more time, give it up for uh, Mary, and Two, and Kate, and Mitch, and all the artists, and all the people who are Thank you so much. Bye-bye.